Hey guys and welcome back to the money game with AC. I want to make this one really quick. So it's updating you about SOS, I mean, SOS Limited, uh, um, um, what happened today and what I consider is to be one of the biggest player we can see rising up into the crypto or the Bitcoin blockchain slash mining, you know, ecosystem, you know, moving forward. And for that reason, you know, see with me that at the end of this video, you will get to the same conclusion that it might be not too crazy to expect a short squeeze to continue i mean to to still happen given um and the data we're gonna go into in a second so first off today was really a bad day across all miners even some of the companies that are highly uh directly exposed to bitcoin like tesla for example you know where it were, were down like four percent which is you know really i mean it's non-negligible, all right? So if you look at Riot, for example, Riot down 15%, um, Mara down 15, 16%, and Bitcoin as well, you know, Bitcoin didn't really hold that 64, 63,000, which I think was expected because a lot of people are day trading this thing. And uh, whenever it gets to a new high, it doesn't matter whether it's a crypto or stock, you know, the tendency that it will pull back because of people taking profits. But the fact that it's now getting back to that 62, 63, I guess if it holds there, we can definitely see it popping to even higher than 64,000. And Coinbase also went public today. You know, it started at $400 and then it came back a little bit to 370, a little bit under 370, which is expected with the IPO. So the really interesting thing will be how it goes moving forward. But back to SaaS, People took money out of profits yesterday specifically and then today, you know, they, I guess they just put money into, into Coinbase. So, SOS has a short interest of 18%, you know, which is non-negligible. And um, if you look at the borrow fee rate right here, this is 42%. On AMC, it's 9% currently. So, this is huge. This is amazing and consider the market cap of a company like SOS Limited man this is definitely a good indicator of this stock being heavily shorted and uh, with the the the, 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 the the catalyst that I'm gonna share with you in a second you will see that why I think it's still very a good candidate for a short quiz to happen first one if um, this article for from um, Yahoo that uh, was published two days ago you know um, the company enters into a non-binding letter of intent to acquire majority equity interest on three US-based power plants aiming to expand its crypto mining operations into North America. You know, so it's a Chinese company and the fact that they were able to, I mean, they are intent or intentional about getting into the US soil and increase their capacity into the mining is definitely one of the biggest signs we can expect in terms of you know this company being legit or no okay so i'm i'm, I'm not going to get into the details around you know the whole lawsuits and uh, this company being legit or no but definitely this transaction proceed the company will publicly disclose additional information through press releases to the sec filing as appropriate so you don't intend to be to, to take those big 51 percent in uh, membership and ownership into u.s companies without having to file some kind of paper work with the sec and the in the u.s authorities so that's just one thing now it will give um sus i mean sos limited an incredible you know competitive edge given the 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 the, the this other article that is you know kind of shedding light around um sos limited triple digit growth potentially driving stock to successive new highs. So we currently have four million, I mean four hundred million dollars in cash on the books. Uh, so they are still profitable and they have money in case you know something weird like COVID happen against. And um, the really interesting thing here is the positioning. Okay, so S uh, Source Limited is uniquely due to its recent business pivot. In the classic mold of the emerging growth stocks, Source is building triple digit growth that may have longevity. Okay, just because they are positioning themselves around multiple niches into a high growth sector, which is tech and crypto, but they are developing IP in global greenfield opportunities, blockchain, AI, cloud computing, big data, and IoT at a leading edge technologies being advanced at SOS Limited. So 
even though on the website it mentions that they are kind of an emergency uh, 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 um, technology company, you know, they are entering these new uh, uh, operations into crypto mining, into everything else associated with it. I even heard about crypto insurance. So definitely they are positioning themselves in order to be to have much more source of revenues. Um, other than companies like Mara and Riot, you, which are mainly, you know, miners. And the fact that they did have that offering, you know, to raise $125 million capital to inject back into the business, to me, long term is definitely something to take into consideration that will bring much more people to buy much more interest from Wall Street and from retails. And that will potentially, you know, squeeze the shorts. OK. And then finally, Another article from Investor Place on why Source Limited can become a long term crypto mining play. All right. So um, rapidly expanding the mining business. The primary reason it's the, um, the crypto mining firepower, which spells trouble for its competition. OK, so SOS, I mean, or SOS Limited right now has about 10,000 crypto miners, of which 50% are already operations and delivering Bitcoin revenues. The other 50% is currently being installed and configured. It expects a significant bump in revenues where when the other 50% of crypto miners will be operational, okay? The third batch of roughly 5,600 miners will be in deployment very soon, which will take the tally up to 15,600 miners in total. To put into things in perspective, the industry uh, uh, um, main benchmark, Riot Blockchain, has about roughly 11,500 miners operational, which points to a sizable advantage for SOS Limited moving forward. So, and they are also not, I think they are also targeting um, Ethereum mining, not only Bitcoin mining. So, guys, just to put everything in perspective to end this video, there are much more catalysts coming in because there are so many things in the pipeline for SOS Limited, you know, that I don't even mind short squeeze aside. This is a great company to be part of, you know, uh, uh, um, at this specific time where a lot more people, a lot more people in the market, whether institution or retails are trying to get into crypto. And the fact that Bitcoin, I mean, SOS is positioning themselves in order to benefit not only from one, two or, you know, multiple source of in income and revenues from that, you know, they are definitely poised to beat the Mara and the Red in terms of, you know, miners as well or technology, uh, uh, that cutting edge technology. So that's why I will continue to hold. Um, if you're interested in buying source, I think right now it's a good entry point. But, you know, as every time I'm not putting all my capital, you know, it doesn't matter whether you have to average up or average down, just in case, you know, there is a confirmation that it's going up or there's a confirmation, I mean, or it's a pullback, then you can, you know, average it down a little bit in order to high more, add more um, 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 firepower to your portfolio. All right, thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Until then, take care, bye.